most people in America are familiar with what their rights are if you're of my generation. But we have a brand new group of generation of kids coming up in America who got technology way too young. They haven't really learned how to perform their life without technology, without an iPad, without a computer. And while it's marvelous, we're teaching them how to use technology so they can function in life. But what are we teaching them about real life? Where's the real life class? Where's the cooking class? Where's the sewing class for those families that don't have somebody who's full of class and knows how to do that? Where's the culinary arts class? You see, we have to look at the function of America. And the function of America is pretty straightforward. We have religion as a pastime, as a part-time thing. But we have eating as a full-time thing. So what we should really be producing all across America in American classrooms is culinary artists who create really good food on inexpensive opportunities of food. We really have to change the entire structure of American education to teach math and science, sure, for living. And any child that has a gift like we've seen in that gift, I think it was called Numbers, that was marvelous, of the black woman who helped save the astronauts, with Kevin Costner, I don't remember what the heck it was called, Crunching Numbers, I don't know, Number Crunching, I don't know. It was a great film, I saw it. It's the only film, only film in my life I had seen with one of my sisters. It's possible she and I went to Harry Potter once, but I don't think so. I had pretty much a different sibling that I did all those things with. But what I'm saying to you is not about that experience of who I did that with. What I'm saying to you is that in order for America to survive, the next generations that are coming, and the winter and the weather and all the things, we have to pluck kids out of their early childhood elementary classes when they have gifts in math and go, there's your math track, go. Here's your science track, go. Here's your military track, go. But more importantly, we have to take a whole group of people and say, here's culinary arts, here's customer service, here's serving in a restaurant, here's feeding people, here's farming, here's horsemanship, here's cowing, what are those called? Animal husbandry, go. You see, America cannot survive without our food industry. Here's manufacturing, go. Does that make sense? That education in America is failing America for our future. And children are being entitled to think that they're going to spend their whole life playing online and Facebook and social media and other things like a marketing man like me has to. And that's the lie we're telling them. They're not establishing what they want to do. They have no clue what they want to do by the time they hit high school. And that's a lie that we're telling them. That they'll have plenty of time in college to figure that out, but a lot of them still remain lost because they have no faith foundation for their life. They have no legal training in their life in terms of what the laws are and the rights of them versus the rights of others. And that's a problem. That's an abuse of our children. And that's a failure of your family if you didn't teach them those things.